You okay? I just ran. Should I start? Whenever you're ready. Yeah. Okay. Um, hi, my name is Lloyd Briggery. I'm from Goldsboro, North Carolina, but I got to the school by way of Brooklyn, USA. Uh, anyway, um, I am. Uh, it took me 13 years to get to the school. I was gonna go right out of high school, but I had already signed up for the army, and they decided to send me to college. And I had been in for three months when I uh, saw the ad for the school, and I thought it was a joke. And uh, my uh, local comic book shop owner is a guy named Bob, who was a Marine sniper in his former life. Um, I said, hey, Bob, get a load of this, <laughs> a comic book school. And Bob looked at me like this. And then I was like, you get it? It's a comic school. <laughs> get it? Like, what a joke, right? And he goes. Then I was like. You're not understanding the humor in the, <laughs> in the joke. And he said, it's a real school, man. You should probably check it out. And so I checked it out. Upon which time I tried to get out of the army and college, but I was already committed. And so 13 years later, um, the window of opportunity opened up and I came here. And it's, uh, it's, it has been totally worth it. I would do it all over again just to get back. Um, my time here has far exceeded my expectations and um, just like to thank a couple people um, mom what up thanks so much for uh, always telling me I could do it um, Steven thank you for always supporting me and really uh, taking time to figure out what it is I do and what I care about um, and Bridget I mean come on now I couldn't have made it without you so thank you so much for all your support um, so, yeah, hey, look, I love you guys. Uh, class of 2014, some lived, some died, but we made it, and uh, it's all good. I can't wait to uh, run into everybody at the cons in the future. And, um, yeah, Excelsior. <laughs> Hello, my name is Harold Jensen. I'm from Guatemala. Um, I just uh, want to thank some people. Uh, the teachers at the school, really great. Uh, my classmates, and I also want to thank my parents for all the support that they gave me for me being here. Uh, my grandma, I love you, um, and uh, my friends back home, and all my friends here. Uh, I just want to say thank you all. Hi everybody, I'm Alexia Feldhuizer. I'm from Amsterdam, and I'd like to thank each and every one of you at the school for making this whole thing possible, for making me and all my classmates graduate on this very day. I want to thank the ladies at the office, I want to thank all of the teachers, especially Adam and then of course Joe Kubert for again establishing your school and making my dreams possible. And I want to thank all my classmates for making these three years amazing. These were like the best years of my life ever. So again, thank you so much. Hey, my name is Bill Cooper. I'm from uh, Union, New Jersey. Um, I'd like to thank my parents, my girlfriend, my family, um, my friends, and uh, let me see. Coming to the Cubert School was an interesting experience. I learned more than I thought I ever would in my entire life, and I can't be, like I said before, any more thankful. Hello, my name is Daniel Billick. I'm from Milford, New Jersey. I'm just here to say thank you to all my teachers for teaching me everything about art that I have obviously no clue of what I was doing towards like through high school and everything and just the fact that they got me so much closer to my dream of uh, creating my own series and I, I'd like to thank my parents too for giving me all the support in the world my dad for drive me every now and then to school, probably more than I drive myself. 
Hi, my name is Devin Williams. I'm from Joplin, Missouri. First off, I want to thank my mom and dad for helping me make this all possible. I couldn't have done it without you guys. I also want to thank the instructors here. I've learned something from each and every one of you that's helped me improve myself as an artist. And also, I want to thank the Q-Words, Adam and Andy, uh, for not only keeping the school alive, but Joe's legacy alive. For anybody who's ever dreamed of being in the comic book business, whether they're an artist, an inker, an editor, whatever it may be, this school gives them that opportunity to get their foot in the door, and we are super grateful for that. And I also want to thank everybody I've ever met at the school for making this a memorable three years. Thank you. Hello, my name is Esau Figueroa. I'm from Monterrey, Mexico, and I would like to thank everybody here at school. Uh, I, I would like to thank my teachers, I would like to thank uh, everybody at staff, my friends, and everybody who made possible um, for me and all of my classmates to be graduating on this day. Um, to Mr. Joe Kubert, to the Kubert brothers, and my parents, my girlfriend, and all of you, I really, really love you, and I would like to thank you for allowing me to be here right now, and thank you very much. Hey guys, uh, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Aries Tavares, I'm from the Bronx, New York, and I just wanted to take a minute to say thank you um, to the staff, to my teachers, most importantly to my classmates who really made this experience amazing. Um, and I want to travel 16 days into the future. Look at you, buddy, looking sexy in your suit there. You made it. I'm proud of you. See you later. Hi, my name is Mike Brandstetter. I'm from Stroudsburg, Pennsylvania, and I just want to thank everyone at the Kubert School for making this a great three years. I want to thank my parents for always supporting me and not forcing me to be like a doctor or a lawyer or anything like that. Um, I want to thank my girlfriend Lexi for being supportive too. And I want to thank my sister Trisha for all the years of encouragement and for being a great friend. And I want to thank all my friends here who have made these three years be the best three years they could be. Thank you. Hi, my name is Jim Moon and I am from South Korea and thinking back in my first year, I was really terrible in every drawing <laughs> and I really want to express my deepest thankful thankfulness to every teacher and I also want to express my great thankfulness to my classmate, Louis Harold. Sorry, I'm really terrible in memory things, <laughs> memory things. And Louis Harold, Daniel, Alex, Dropper, Gil, and also Rubin. Damian, Ernesto, Mike, Aries, Alexia, and Devin. You guys helped me so much so I could improve more. Thank you very much, everyone. Thank you. Hi, my name is Alex Conti. I am 30 years old, and I'm from White Plains, New York, where I've lived all my life. It's been a great few years here at the Kubrick School. I've, I've learned so much, it's, it's unbelievable. I think uh, anyone who comes to this school and puts as much as they can put into it, we'll get as much as they can out, and hopefully with that, they'll put a lot of themselves into it, because, you know, they're just going to be borderline or less, I mean, who wants that? Throughout all these years, I really, I, first off, I want to thank my mother, a former acquaintance of mine, slash somewhat friend, <laughs> who actually, without their guidance, I wouldn't be here, and if it wasn't for seeing my a friend, the friend of mine getting me into comics, and me seeing the ad of, the, of at the time, the Joe Kubert School, in the uh, comics and being interested, especially in the sense that these artists that I've noticed that were have graduated and gone on to have successful careers were people I admired. So from there, I, I you know this that's what really brought me to the school. And once I took the tour here, I was hooked. So I basically applied, got accepted, thankfully, <laughs> and you know then I and now I'm graduating, and it's amazing. It's an amazing feeling to to know that I've actually accomplished something like such so big. So I want to thank all the teachers that have, have taught me over the years, uh, especially Michael Craiger and Darren Hawk and Mike Chen, of course, and Andy and Adam Hubert. And um, I want to say, you know, re you know rest, rest in peace, Joe. You were one of the best. Hey, my name is Ruben Ruiz. I'm a current graduate of the Hubert School. And I'm just very grateful to be here. Um, I came here about five years ago. Little things happened, but I was able to come back again. And I met some really awesome people in my at this school. I met some great friends that I'll keep for life. 
I learned so much, so much you don't even know. And I'm just grateful for Adam, Andy, and the late Joe Kewer for just, you know, being here and running the school. And, uh, yeah, just had a really good time being here. Learned so much. Hi, my name is Damien. I am from Yonkers, New York. And I would like to thank the Kubert School for giving all of the students a great opportunity to better ourselves as artists and get into the professional field. I'd like to thank the Kuberts, all of our teachers, of course my classmates, and Bridget for helping third year be an awesome year. I'd also like to thank my parents for all the love and support and believing in me and what I can do. Uh, my grandfather for the tremendous amount of support. He's helped me a lot in the past couple years. Uh, my sister, you're a bum, <laughs> but she's amazing. Um, and she's helped me a lot through, you know, just talk. And in the moments where, you know, you don't feel as strong about things, uh, she's helped me out a lot. Um, and my girlfriend, <laughs> Aisha. Hello everybody, my name is Ernesto Sin from Mexico, 22 years old. Uh, super grateful for being here at the school, for, you know, graduating from this school. I, I, before coming here, this was completely utopia, a dream, and I, I made it in the end, thanks, of course, to all my friends, my family, super supportive all the time, uncles, sponsors, everybody. I've made, you know, super awesome friends here for life that I'm going to keep. Uh, it has been a great experience since the beginning to the very end. A lot of learning, a lot of grow, growing up. It has been great. Thanks, of course, to Joe, Andy, Adam, who you know made this possible. And it, it's, a, it's one step closer to everybody's dream, I would say, and I'm very grateful for that. Thanks a lot. In all seriousness, um, I want to thank my dad. Uh, I know you've been through a lot this year, and you stayed strong through it all. Um, I don't know how I would have made it without you. Uh, Chris, my baby brother, you literally made this possible. Um, without your signature, I would have never made it through the door. Uh, my little sister, my baby, my princess, um, you know, I, I watched you grow up, and now you're here for me, celebrating with me, and Kitty. Tabby, um, I love you more than anything, and when I had given up on the dream altogether, he pushed me to move forward. So, love you. The most important lesson that I learned in the Kubert School. That's a hard one. I guess it would be to. Uh, I learned so much things. I learned so many things. Um, I couldn't classify it as something as um, like in a hierarchy of importance, but um, I learned to be a better person. I mean, but that's horrible how to act professional, um, you know, being social, making friends, talking to people, uh, networking, and just being professional, like working in an environment, learning to take critiques, learning to give critiques correctly, you know, um, and just, you know, learning how to take all that and apply it to your artwork. That was the biggest, the number one thing, I mean, among a million other things, but that, that's number one by far.
probably just having a good work ethic, which is probably surprising to some people to hear me say that, like, but like, if you knew how I was before I came here, I had like zero work ethic, and it turned me into a pretty decent worker. I get work done sometimes. The most important lesson I learned at the Keyword School was to let go of your ego. It will not help you. Your, your job is to make sure the product and your work is good, even that means passing it off to someone else. That's, you hold no attachment to it. Meeting deadlines. Um, having gone through school, you know, throughout elementary school, middle school, high school, etc. You get deadlines for your assignments, but those deadlines are nothing like the deadlines we get at this school. Um, it really teaches you a level of professionalism that the industry needs and requires. And um, getting pages done weekly, uh, assignments, pencils, inks, colors, it's just a very strenuous uh, exercise, but it's helped so much. And without that lesson alone, I don't think many of us can get the, uh, the amount of work output that we do get. What was it like on my first day of school? Nerve wracking. Um, this was something I never thought I was going to accomplish. I actually found out about the school when I was 10. It took me nearly 20 years to get the money together to get here. Um, I was a nervous wreck. It was kind of scary and awkward at the same time because nobody was really talking. Um, we were trying to figure out our computer set up and I was sitting there with my roommate at the time and we just like, like we knew each other because we'd seen each other in the house but we didn't really know each other but I I can't remember exactly who started but I think somebody started cracking a dirty joke and then everybody started talking and then that kind of helped bond the whole class um, and that bond lasted for three years so that was really cool. I came here, well, thanks to my uncle, Daniel, who was helping me a lot, and I'll thank you so much for that. He was, uh, well, I attend here, it was orientation day, and, well, he was right there with me all the time. I saw my class, you know, 1C, I sat there, the only place available, available, and all of a sudden, well, you know, I was nervous because first time in a country alone, different language, you know, I wasn't that confident with English, and somebody poked my back, and I just turned and I see Aries, you know, right there and he, the moment he spoke in Spanish, whatever you need, I'm right here. I, I just felt the angels all talking to me. Like, I was just like, thank you. And I just, you know, it was great. I, uh, since that day on, I felt the, the, all the, how can I, uh, that somebody was like supporting me since day one and he has been with me all the time. You know, along with Damien and basically all 1C, you know, my friends, but uh, I, I really thank you for that, Aries and Damien, and well, my family and everything. That was my first day at school, and he has been awesome since day one. That had to be, well, I have two. One, the first time I went to Comic Con with everybody, because we're right there, we were starting to bonding together. Um, we were starting to get to know each other, so that, oh, that was really cool. And the other moment would be when we went all to see, oh, what was the movie? The Avengers, yes. I just remember that I had such a great time, I, didn't, I was forgetting the movie, but uh, there were like, we were like 20, and we got a hold of the uh, whole theater, and it was, it was like, like, a, like a huge part. That was, that was really cool. Just spending time with everyone that I grew up with, like for these last three years, learning art. My friend Harold Jensen, my friend uh, Paul, who wasn't here for our last year in school. <laughs> and Ernesto, Bridget, we have Mike, Branstetter, Damien, Aries, whoever else isn't here right now. But, um, I don't know what to say anymore. <laughs> I 
the workload? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alex Stevens, Marco Cachorro, Todd Downing, Lucy John Teal, Giovanni Valletta, Pai Eisman, Rob Orenshaw, Bob Harden, Michael Prager, Mike Pereira, Ryan Booty, Mike Chen, Carol Thomas, Darren Off, Hayner, Lenny Ruiz, Jan Gershma, Kim De Mulder, Joel Tayu, Terry Clem, Rich De Jesus, John Hazard, Dorothy Morley, Tom Mandrake, Doug Compton, Anthony Evans Abato, Fabio Redivo, Andy Kubert, Adam Kubert, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Gotta think about it. <laughs> Sorry. Um, okay. So, Damien, please. Hello. My name is Damien Torres. I'm from the Yon I'm from Yonkers, New York. Uh, I just want to take a moment to thank everyone in the crowd for admiring me, because I'm Batman. <laughs> oh man, I, I actually should have did that while I was doing the Damien impersonation. Oh, uh, because you front row. Question. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Whenever you're ready, dude. Somebody's calling me. Who the fuck is this? <laughs> hey, man. Uh, probably not. I got. I gotta record something. I gotta record something. I was wondering who that was. <laughs> it was just like a random number that came up on my phone. Really? Yeah. So that was weird. And the other moment would be when we went out to see... Oh, what was the movie? Which one? Avengers. The Avengers, yes. I just remember that I had such a great time. I, didn't, I was forgetting the movie, but... Uh, Dead Red. Dead Red. Dead Red. That's probably my favorite moment, but I can't say that. 
Oh. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> this is the last day of school last year because I knew I'd yeah. never see him again. Someone asked a question. What was the most important lesson you learned while attending the Hubert School? What did you have for breakfast? <laughs> what did I have for breakfast? Of course! <laughs> Just a, a, a honey bun. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not thinking. I'm not thinking, Tanner, man. You're and it has to be off that missile. My name is Devin Williams. I'm from Joplin, Missouri. I want to thank my parents for helping make this all possible. I couldn't have done it without you guys. You ready? Is he bothering you? I feel like I'm getting grilled, like I committed a crime. <laughs> <laughs> What was the wait, most? Wait, wait, wait. Damn it, man! Seriously? <laughs> <laughs> this, is my, this is my moment. <laughs> and then he said, he like fast forwarded to his future self and said he looked really sexy in his suit. Oh, yeah. And then, uh, you know, like he was speaking oh, to people at right, like he was like, oh, Ernesto, Raldi, like that. Like, you, yeah, can, you do can do that. <laughs> you can do that. Yay, you know? Okay. I mean, he... In this an awesome experience, I want to thank my parents for always letting me do, like, freaking shit. <laughs> you were doing well, very well. I know, I was doing good, right? Yeah, you were doing very what good. Do yeah, you were doing good. You say, my, my parents for supporting me all the time. That's Thanks the my word girlfriend. I was looking for. I forget words. My parents for letting me do fucking shit. <laughs> yeah, they're letting me do fucking shit. <laughs> Wait, just just cut it. We'll cut it and yeah, just yeah. start going. Now say supporting me. Mm -hmm. Go. Hi, my name is Mike. Uh, oh wait. So no, no, it's fine. You you should start again. You start again. Boop, boop. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I also want to thank the instructors here. I've learned something from each and every one of you. Yeah. That was his best start ever. That was all. <laughs> okay, on your mark, this is set. <laughs> on your mark, get set. Tadoni? Go. Tadoni. <laughs> <laughs> My name's, I didn't want to hear that, and it made me laugh. You can say that. I didn't yeah, learn anything from this dude. I learned everything I know from the book, from the dude of Hard Knocks and Jet Turbot. <laughs> Have like a cereal box with Kirby Crackle and just like. That read, I learned it. Turby, turby, turby. This is the best way to wake up to any morning that a fresh bowl of Turby Trattles. Turby Trattles. That read. You know what we're talking about. Turby Trattles. Okay. Are we recording? Yeah. Are we recording? Yeah. Oh, all right. Hi, my name's Mike Brandstead. He's doing things. <laughs> That's awesome. I'm bored. Oh, I don't want to be bored. I'm not really bored. I'm just messing. <laughs> How are you fun? Is my leg in the frame? No. <laughs> did, you, did you just do the basic instinct? <laughs> All right, all right. Friend and sibling. You can have that sibling point out. I want to thank um, my girlfriend, Lexi, for making this a great year and also fucking shit. How do I say, like, it makes it difficult? Like, yeah, you we'll didn't make I don't it think difficult supporting. being apart. Already, just why don't you just say, right. I want to thank my sister. I want to thank my. Right. Giving everyone the. Uh, cool. Don't worry, don't, <laughs> worry, don't, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. Yeah. Keep them rolling. Okay, one, two. Hello, my name is Mike Brandstetter. Everyone at this Cubert School for. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> one more time, and go. Hold on. It's fine, it's fine. Don't worry. Just Can I write it down first? Sure. Yeah, if you want. Word. Harold, where are you? Yeah. That's my boy Harold. That's my boy Harold. Yo. What's up, guys? Sally. My favorite memory at the Cubert School. Or maybe not the favorite memory, but what's something that you cherish? <laughs> something that you cherish about the school, something that you're going to take to your house or life. You know what I mean? Well, to be taking back all my art supplies. Of course. My desk. My bed. What was my favorite experience at the Cubert School? 
Um, just all the friends I made and getting a display case to myself wasn't half bad either. Center display though. Yeah, center display. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> hey, yeah that was a good one. That was good. <laughs> that was good. Okay, not that though. <laughs> That's gonna be like... <laughs>